Hi everyone, welcome to the M9 TOC Talks on Data Pro 2. This is our second part of the series that focuses on information around icons. In our last session, we went over the home screen that you see here. For this one, we thought we would provide you details on these icons at the top left of the home screen. These icons include a home screen, a favorites folder, configuration, the maintenance icon, data management, data guard, and finally the help icon. Let's have a look at the favorites icon. Uh, we are dedicating a special talk on setting up protocols and methods from the favorites icon, but for now let's highlight the three main sections. They are protocols, methods, and system protocols. Next, uh, configuration and settings. You can see there are three tabs, um, general settings, results, and data storage. All three tabs are important to the user interface for Data Pro 2. These functions allow users to set up default properties for methods like flow rates, display options like time and language, and archive and backup frequency. Now let's go to the maintenance icon. Selecting this icon allows users to perform backups, archives, check consumables, which is really, really important, troubleshoot issues with the auto sampler, or check warnings, errors, and alerts. The data management icon helps users to view, search, and print previous measurements and protocols. The results list gives you a tabular selection of the previous tests run on the unit whereas the results search tab helps you get more refined in searching for data. Data Guard is the M9's 21 CFR Part 11 feature. This icon allows users to create and manage user accounts and access levels, settings desired for security, and to view the audit trail there on the right. And finally, the help icon provides general system information and the electronic documentation. That's about it on Data Pro 2 icons. Hopefully you found this helpful and be sure to check out our other info videos.